Hey, 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 gamers, and welcome in. Hey, thanks for the resub. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Nice way to start off the stream today. Uh, but today we're doing uh, we're doing another Mapper Days. But today we're not doing Portal Two. We're not doing Gary's Mod. We're not even doing anything on the Source Engine in particular. Today I wanted to look at a mod for Super Mario 64's fan-made PC port called Super Mario 64 Plus. Uh, it's a fun little mod that adds a bunch of uh, a bunch of small things to the game. Uh, also, sorry about the music at the start of this stream. I uh, I didn't think to go through and uh, play the music. You know, I I I because the game has music in it. But like apparently the launcher's music doesn't read on my, uh, it doesn't read on my uh, mixer, and so you know it's not coming through on the stream, which sucks. But you know what can you do? Anyway, this is what we're playing today. Uh, but you know obviously it's Mapper Day. I wanna I wanna kind of stick in the realm of like changed maps. And so, first thing we're gonna do is go in here to our settings. I'm playing on mouse and keyboard, by the way, because I couldn't... Like, I tried multiple controllers, and I couldn't get any of them to pick up on this. Um, let's see, what do we got? Hmm. Just having a look around here. Custom camera on. There we go. Uh, there's one particular gameplay thing that I wanted to try out. Extra modes. Oh, extra moves. No, restorations. No, bonus modes. Here we go. I wanted to try out the encore mode as, as sort of a thing to try. First thing I want to do today, though, is... Uh, permadeath mode. Uh, in which you have only one life. Once you die, your save data gets deleted with no way to restore it. Only for those who want to want the ultimate challenge. Warning, if you start a game or save an ex or an existing save slot with permadeath mode on that save slot, it will forever be stuck in permadeath mode. Whatever. Let's start the game. Now, I assume it's going to break a little bit. And, uh, oh. I'm trapped in having my mouse captured. Hold on. There we go. I finally- I'm free! I'm free! So let's back our jams out of here real quick. And see. Is it picking up the uh, game's music? It is! Thank goodness it's picking up the actual game's audio. Uh, let's, let's get the game window fixed, shall we? to display the proper window. Come on. Yeah, here we go. Look at those graphics. We're gaming now, fellas. Oh. Does not like having the window moved around. All right, so we're trying permadeath mode first, just cause I, I started a file and did some goofing around privately. But we'll boot up file B and we'll take a crack at the permadeath mode. And see if we can uh, if we can get some stuff done here, because I want to try this out and I want to want to see if this mod is actually any good. Because from what I played of it, it's fine, and I played long enough to get used to the keyboard controls. Almost like there are still a couple things that's like eh, I'm not quite you know I'm not quite familiar yet, but I'm getting there. And uh, Mario 64 is one of those games that I've played so many times that it's practically second nature at this point. That I'm able to just, you know, crack that out. So, uh, yeah, let's get into it. Yahoo. Look at him. Do the Mario. But no, yeah, we've got the custom camera mode here. And it's a little more zoomed out than the traditional Mario 64 cam. Come on. This is a lot nicer, though, to just have mouse camera controls. Yeah, whatever. I don't need the text. I don't need the text. I'm playing in permadeath mode. You think I care about the text? We got a couple extra moves from Mario 64. 
as like a departure from Mario 64's traditional move set. Uh, but, you know, such as like the uh, the bounce out of a ground pound, if I can get it to work. There we go. And uh, the ability to see through walls, my goodness. I didn't realize that this camera mode uh, broke that a little bit. We'll just have to be careful in these interior spaces, yeah? And then I keep trying to hit spacebar to jump, but spacebar is our start button. So, another little change that I've made, personally, is being able to... Uh, being able to get all the stars in a level without having to leave said level. It's one of the extra features of this that I have turned on for this. Because I think it'd be more fun that way. To have a little goof about, you know? We're missing a coin. That's fine. Uh, let's, uh, let's scrounge around for as many coins as we can get here in the beginning. And then, you know, by the time, by the time we're done, we'll have a hundred coins. And it'll just be done and dusted. Let me grab that coin. I want the red coins, too. Let me up. Here we are. Yeah, come get me. Idiot. Haha, <laughs> dummy. Oh, that was a waste. Oh. Again, I gotta be careful of permadeath and all that. Ah, oh, come on. Let me alone, Shane Chomp. These camera controls are fucking me a little bit. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Give me out, 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 give me out. Okay, alright, there's a red coin over there. That'll keep me going. It'd be so embarrassing if I touted, like, oh, yeah, no, I've played Mario 64 a shitload of times, and then, you know, I sit down to play it, and, like, <clears throat> I die before collecting one singular star. Oh my god. The slope speed he got off that. Come on. Okay, I was thinking he was going to run at me, so I was going to have an easier time there. That's okay. We're going to have to come through here and get all these coins eventually anyway. Again, these mouse and keyboard controls are a departure that I'm still getting used to. I'm, I'm familiar with what all the buttons do now, I think. It's just I still do things like that, where it's like, oh yeah, no, space bars jump in PC games. So I'm still using, like, WASD to move. And so it's, it's, a, it's a learning curve, I feel. For sure it is. Okay, so let's, uh, let's go ahead and get our first star. Uh, actually, let's get this coin from this little fella here. Oh my god, I, I gotta adapt. I gotta learn. I have to learn that jumping does not work that way anymore. Come at me. Thank you. Ah, oh, come on. I was hoping I could time that right. There's a point in ground pounds where you just go through whatever object you're trying to... Or whatever object might come into your path. And oh... Here we are, first star of the run. Now I'm no speed runner at all when it comes to this game. I, I know a couple tricks here and there, but like I'm not I'm not like supremely good at it or anything. Uh, I don't know that I'm gonna get all all of the stars, but I'm gonna do my best to get as many as I can within you know within this stream because I want to try out the there's also the encore mode which changes how the courses look, and I want to give that a stab too. Before we're done here. Uh, let me get these red coins first. And then I'll do the running around the pillars. Because that's... That's as easy as just lining the camera up. And, uh... Oh, it's much harder this way. I might switch the camera mode back. To how it was. Because it still wasn't... It wasn't great there. But it was alright. I'll do... I'll do this for this run. And see if I can adjust. And then when we go to Encore mode, if I haven't adjusted to it by then, then we'll change it then. Because I don't want to be closing and reopening the game constantly to change settings. Every coin, every coin counts. Every last one of them. Not that we need every last one of them, but I don't want to miss out if we, uh, if we can get them all, you know. Oh, oh, oh. And one of them went over here. Get him! Please, thank you. Yo, green demon. Oh, 
Oh boy, another coin off this little fella. Pop one off. Another one up. Not that they matter. Not that they matter, like, at all here. Come on. Run me through. Thank you. And give me another man. And then soon we're going to have to go take out Big bob -omb. Soon, soon, soon. Won't be right this second, but uh, there's no Koopa the Quick here. Oh, that means we're gonna have to like go to his specific star to do that. Oh, that's lame. Oh well. So you have to reset for a couple things. I was able to get all the stars in one go when I was doing my tester last night. I don't see, I don't see what the problem would be with that here, but you know. Oh well. Let's go ahead and come up here and get this red coin. Because we should almost have them all. We're at 65 coins already. That's super good for the moment. Alright, we're up to seven. And the eighth one is on the floating island. So then we're good to go. But no, yeah, Super Mario 64 is one of those games that I've been wanting to play on stream. And that I probably will play on stream at some point in earnest. Like, unmodded. I thought about using this version, but if, if I do a full, like, honest playthrough of this, I definitely want to do it with a controller. I might even be able to do, do it with console, honestly, because now I have all, like, the hookups I would need for that. I just need to see how, like, there are just small things, like, oh, how does, uh, I won't take the teleporter just this once, so that I can worry about getting these coins instead. Oh no, I might not be able to get to the floating island yet if these cannons aren't going to open. Because, like, Koopa the Quick's not here, which worries me quite a bit. Oh yeah, we got a heart over here. Yeah, check that out. That's some gamer stuff right there. We are hella gamer right now. Come on. Have at me. Have at me, please. You are so slow. And throw him. We might be able to just uh, whip around and pick him right back up. If we give him a wide berth here. Oh, come on. Whoop, oh, can't catch me. Can't catch me. Come on. Have at me. Yeah, there we go. And one more. One more? Yes, okay, now one more. And we'll have this guy dealt with. Oh, come on. I swear he gets slower as this progresses. Like, he turns, like, on a dime, though, which doesn't feel right to me, ever, because it's like, you can't get behind him very easily. Not that I expect it to be stone easy, but, like, it is the first star of the game. Come on, now. Like, it's the first mission the game sends you on, and it's like, oh, yeah. What, do you expect it to be easy? Yes, kind of. We hey, we got another star. Okay, we're up to two now. Uh, we need to get back to the start of the stage. To talk to the pink bob -omb over here. Come on, talk to me. Have at me. It's dangerous falling bob -omb's. Yes, 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 I know. Ah, oh, well. I think that kills our run if we can't have all the red coins. Because if we can't... Like, not only can we not have all the red coins, but we can't get up to the island at all like this. That's lame. We'll come back through then. Come back through on a separate mission.
I think it's because I have star select on is why this happens. Come on. Open the cannon for me. Thank you. All right, 100 coins this time. Now we have the, uh, like, star two is, like, the perfect setup to get everything done. Usually. And that might have been what I what happened as I ended up selecting star two. Come on. Thank you. All right. Again, these keyboard controls are very slowly killing me. But that's fine. We'll see how far we can get here. I noticed that the lives counter is gone now. I can collect a few coins along my path here. Actually, I think I should probably focus up. You can't use... Fun fact, you can't use the cannons or else they'll accuse you of cheating. The teleports, though, are fair game. Come on, I can't help myself. I gotta at least get a couple of the coins that are directly in my path, you know? Oh, come on, let me have it. Let me have it. And ever so slightly course correct. Believe it or not, this is just a hair faster than walking up the mountain. Not by much at all, mind you. But it is indeed faster. Oh, we might get to see him pass here. There he is! Why have I not teleported yet? Wasn't standing in the right spot, I guess. hey -o. I guess in terms of cheating when in a foot race, he didn't account for, like, teleportation. Well, yeah, with permadeath, but, like, that's what I'm saying, is, like, it's a nice detail that they bothered to remove the life counter from the, uh, screen at all. Come on. Hurry it up. Thank you. Give me my star. So I can definitely get through the next few stages like this. Because, like, again, and then it creates, like, for those who haven't played the game, a baseline. Uh, I don't know who in the stream wouldn't have played Mario 64. Like, this is a very, a very, uh, this is the game, right? So, like, I don't, I don't see, I don't see many of us having not played it, you know? Oh, wait, there are more coins over this way that I need to get. I'm just running around, collecting coins and whatnot. Adding to my coin total. Okay, let's see. Whoa, that was a weird camera move. Okay, now we can get this. Not only can we get this, though, this floating island is very important because we also have a star up here. I think that uh, cannon over there on the mountain, I've never thought about it before, but I think that's the one you're supposed to use. Oh, come on, let me get the first secret coin. Thank you. I think that's the one you're supposed to use to get up here, but everybody just uses the first cannon and uh, the first cannon in that field over there. And so, you know. Oh, I didn't get another secret one. Oh, well. That's fine. It's fine. Oh god, I gotta do these runarounds again. Am I giving it too wide of a berth? I think I am. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get it a little tighter than that. Oh, come on. Don't miss the one coin on top of the thing, please. There we go. We just clean this area out. God, I have so much fun with Mario 64. Like, it's such a nice game to just sit down and play. It's like, again, it's one of the video games, in my opinion. That, like, you know, once you begin playing video games, Mario 64 is one that you should check out along your path, you know? There are a lot- honestly, the whole Mario series is just, like, basic elementary school learning, in my opinion. When it comes to, like, in it, to keep up the analogy of, like, learning to play video games. Like, this is Video Games 101 right here. Running around getting collectibles and shit. Let's get this coin. Shmank you. I missed a few red coins off this way. 
Oh, don't want to waste that coin. Gotta have that coinage. And then we're working our way instead. We're working our way backwards this time. Come on, have at me. This bob is blind. Thank you. God. This took him a second. I'm definitely not going to do bomb clip. Even if I were on controller, I don't think I could get that. Oh, did I really just mess up a... I'm usually good at long jumps. Like, long jumps are my saving grace in this game, usually. But, uh... You know, the way they have the long jump buttons bound in this makes it harder. Because I don't have a trigger, you know? I don't know, I'd love to play Mario 64 on console for the stream. Just for the gimmick of it. But, uh, I feel like, you know, the enhanced video quality and maybe doing it in widescreen would be worth, you know? Would be worth just emulating it instead. Where am I missing one? Uh, I got the one up the mountain. I got the one attached to the chain chomp. I got the one on the island. Uh, oh, I didn't get the one behind the grate. That's right. Let's get a couple of these going. What's our coin total up to? 80? Good. 80 will be a good time to go and do those flying coins. Now that's, now that's gonna be a struggle. A little bit. Like, that one's gonna be a bit of a problem for the reason of, uh, give me that coin. For the reason of no wing cap yet. But I want to knock it out now, rather than later. Ah, oh, I just barely saved that. That was almost a death. Or not a death, but I almost fell over. A fate worse than death, truly. Okay, I'll take another stab at it. Nice double jump action. And let's get up and away. I think I need to line up with that pixel in the cloud, if I remember right. Yeah, and that drops me in the tree. Love it when that happens. Either way, this will be a big coin bonus for us. I'm going to aim right there and see what happens. Oh, yeah, we got one. We're up to two of five now. Let's go doing a little more. I think it's this one, right? Or is it the other one? It's this one. Okay. I don't often do that in reverse, and so it's not exactly ingrained in my head which is which. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Come on. Into the thing we go. And again, we line up with that pixel. Having pixelated skyboxes is actually very useful for lining these up. So, I forget exactly where we aimed last time, but I'll try and go for a wild card aim here. Of aiming right on that coin. Well, that coin. Hey, I got another one. That's three. We're filling out our star count. We've only got a few more to grab. One of which being the 100 coin star and the one we're working toward. Ooh, just a narrow miss there. Ah, oh, well. I almost saved it. I almost saved myself. I nearly had it. Don't worry about it. Uh, aim up to that pixel and shoot. Oh, those camera moves. As cool as they look, they're starting to make me nervous. I don't know. I don't know. My brain works at full capacity while playing Mario 64. Hey, that's four. We're still at 92. I walked it back last time. This time we'll take the teleport again. Just because it's slightly faster. Come on, we can save it. No! There we are. Straight in. See, I still think even even without uh even without 
a good control scheme, I'm still pumping out some decent Mario 64 gameplay. Because, like, again, it feels like this game's... Like, I've played it so many times that it feels like this game's code is, like, buried into my brain somewhere, you know? Like, just while I, while I sleep, Mario 64 is running in my brain. Alright, so, real quick, just so that we've got it, I want to get this dealt with and then, you know, go get that uh, last red coin. Because I don't want the final... Uh, Yeesh, it might have to be that way if I can't uh, get a couple more of these. Oh, two of balls. Higher than the national average. This game is like never forgetting to ride a bike. Exactly, you pick it up and you play it, and then it's just in you forever. Uh, let's get this final red coin down here. And that's red coin star. And don't really need the one-up because permadeath. Alright, and then drop me that. Hoorah. Alright, let's see. It's looking like we're gonna have to settle for... Uh, it's looking like we're gonna have to settle for the thing appearing in the sky. Just for the sake of... Welcome in, by the way. Uh, just for the sake of... Uh, I don't think there are more coins to be had in the level anywhere. Like, I think I've got all the non-sky coins first. Uh, these bob might have a couple. I might be able to crank two coins out of these guys, because I don't think I've had them explode on me yet. It'd be much faster to pick them up and throw them, but, like, with this control scheme, I really don't trust myself to be able to do that effectively, and I can't go playing with my health points. Yeah, that ended up fine. Hey, 100 coin star. Oh, that was a cool camera pan. Usually don't see that. Alright, the secret power star. It's a secret to everyone. Alright, uh, let's get back to getting this last star in the stage. I do like the, uh, the Odyssey style, uh, grab a, grab a, uh, star and remain in the stage thing that they've done here. Oh, okay. I was scared I was a little too high there. We're good, though. We're good. Let's get down and in. and see if we can knock out these last two. Uh, we have to aim hella high to get that. Oh, come on. Come on. No, we undershot. That's okay. We can try again. We only have one more to collect, so... And it's that final one. All right. See, I, I, I was aiming super high, and I felt like I might have even aimed, aimed too high. But I suppose not, if that wasn't good enough. We'll have to, we'll have to check in here. Oop. Okay, it's a very precarious shot. But uh, now that I have a pixel to line it up on, you know, I might be able to... What about that ridge? Is that ridge on, like, the sky texture the spot to aim for? No. Higher than that? Okay, because I've kind of been feeling it out this whole time. I haven't been calculating at all. There we are. And now we just need to come over here. Oh, come on. I always hated the, the cannonballs in this level. I always thought they were super, like... I always thought they were super weird because they're, like, water, for starters, but, like, also, like, just, like, inconvenient random placement on those cannonballs and how they bounce. I wonder whose idea they were. I've never, I've never really heard anybody talk about those cannonballs at all. Okay, what about the next ridge up? That's probably an overshot, yes? Only by a little bit. Only by a little bit. We've got a little aiming to do. But, we're almost there. We're nearly to a point where we can get it. Come on, down we go. Get in there, Mario. We've got a little working around to do here. Right there. Boink. Bonk. Done. Straight in. 
I don't know, controlling the camera with the mouse as wonky as it is, is, uh... Okay, what if I line that top arrow up with the ridge instead? Yeah! Come on, are we gonna land straight on the star? Did I line this up in such a way that we land straight onto it? No, but we almost did. It's a little unsatisfying, but whatever. We made it. We did it. Yeah, we've done it. Okay. Alright, so that's this stage. Now I can exit course with all my stars. That feels super weird, by the way, to do. And then I want to move on to Womps. And uh, see if we can knock out a couple stars over in Womps Fortress. Boy, do I love Mario 64. What a fantastic game. I like Mario Sunshine as well. I want to play the big three at some point in the All-Stars collection. I want to play... Maybe not in the All-Stars collection, literally... But, like, I want to play those three games in one go. Not in one go, but, like, in, like, a marathon of just, like, you know. After I finish one game on stream, I'll, I'll start the other. And then after I finish that game, I'll start the next game. Doing a big Mario marathon at, all at once, though, sounds really fun, too. And I could definitely go for that. Uh, there are coins over there to be collected. Like this. Again, always routing in that 100 coin along with these, like, full star playthroughs. That's that's the beauty and the fun of this, in my opinion, of this particular challenge, is, like, routing in, like, alright, how do I get the eight reds and the hundred coins in, like, a fun and interesting way that, like, is convenient? Oh, no. Not like that. Oh, no! I didn't consider permadeath until it had already happened. Oh, well. So much for our permadeath run. So much for our permadeath, huh? Okay. Let's open up the game's launcher. Oh, no. Well, that was just a warm-up. I wanted to use the permadeath as a warm-up before we got on to trying out the game's encore mode. Uh, you know what? Instead of switching over to the launcher, I'm just going to go ahead and change this over to the encore mode without permadeath. Uh, so the encore mode, uh, as listed here, you can't see it, but as listed here, gives every stage an alternate look via different color palettes and mirrors them all horizontally, which is a fun way to pl replay the original game. I feel like that could be a neat and interesting way of tackling Mario 64, the game in question. Uh, let's start on Mario B again and just, oh, well, Peach is mirrored. So that's something. Alright, it's gonna get crunchy while I move. I love that the text is mirrored too, that's very nice. What a neat little touch that is. Ugh. Does the Castle Grounds have a new color palette as well? Like, is it the whole, whole game, or... No? Oh, this looks so weird. Oh, this looks so unusual. Oh, boy. Does it mirror UI elements? I think that'd be funny, but, like... No, okay. Oh, my goodness. That's really something. Oh, cursed! Oh, this looks so different! And all they did was flip it around! Yo, lock it to skip? Nope. Not gonna bother with it. I've been able to pull it off a couple times, but like... Oh, the text in the text boxes! <laughs> the text in the text boxes is mirrored! Like, in the game... That's hilarious. That's great. I love that. Okay. Alright. So, why is this darker? It's very dark in here. I think I need to go this way. See, now I'm unsure of myself. Oh, gross. Is the painting flipped? I don't think the painting's flipped, no. But that'd be funny. Mario Kart Mirror Cup, yeah. Let's see, what have they done to B.O.B.? I'm not seeing new color palettes here. Like, is it just me, or is, is this, like, identical to how it was? Okay, time to redo B.O.B. again. <laughs> 
Probably huck this at these boxes, honestly. Have an easy enough time. Uh, this time I don't think I'm gonna worry about getting all stars exactly in a level before I leave. I'm gonna get as many as I can simply. And, uh, we're gonna go for the good old 70 star, I think. Oh, that's- this is so weird to see. I don't think I've ever seen this game mirrored, and so... It, uh, it just looks super strange. No, 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 let me off the tree. Please, please, I beg. Alright, let's, uh, free Mr. Chomp here. Ah, oh, come on. Remember how we had a hard time with this when it wasn't mirrored? Yeah, it's looking like that's gonna be the case again. Oh boy. Okay, no, yeah, that's easier. That was easier. Ah, oh, so strange. Even just, even just mirrored. Like, I'd be fine if this were just the mirror. I might have selected mirror only as the option. I might need to go and change that. But now we have one power star, so I can run and do that real quick. Set camera, set camera angle with R. Oh, okay, so that's just the camera change option. All right, so we're, we're going here, and I'm gonna double check my settings and make sure I didn't screw anything up. Uh, sheets, colors. Bonus modes. Uh, encore mode is on. Yeah, no, it's not in any weird way. It just is. Huh. Rear. Love it when that happens. Nice little rear. There we go. Again, I had to move the window. Hello? Okay, here we go. I've got my mouse back. No, 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 no. Don't erase my file, please. Please, I beg of you. I've already lost one save file today. And maybe it just keeps B.O.B. normal? As just a mirror, just to kind of ease you into it? Because this is already very strange on its own. This is already very, very odd and unusual. All right, so off to the races we go here and oh All right bully Knock me off my platform here I mean I suppose he was there first, but oh man this mirror is screwing with me more now Ah Another red coin over here Yoink Ha-ha! Better luck next time, idiot. I, I, uh, every time I play, like, I, I played Mario 64 a lot pre this, but, like, hey, I did the ground pound thingy. Um, why am I freeing him? It feels so second nature to just come into the stage and free him immediately. I don't need that star, I've already got that one. I'm such a fool. Very foolish of me. Okay. But, uh... No, yeah, there was a period of time, like, post-playing this as a kid, where it was, like, uh, for, like, a couple years from, like, I think 2018 to, like, 2020, maybe 2017 even, um, I had, like, the, the simple flips brain rot. I don't know if you're familiar. Oh, I jumped down the wrong side! Alright, I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I'm being a goofy cheater. Being a funny, goofy cheater. Right, we need to go off this way. Yes. Yes. I, I think. I think so. No? Yeah, no, we need to go this way. The spot I want to jump down to is right here. Hey, another red coin on our way. That's nice. Oh god, I almost did it twice. This is this is horrendous, by the way. This is super cursed. Uh, let me open this up in case I fall back down again. How many red coins are we up to? We got them almost all. 
I gotta get the one on the floating island, but that's like it. Wait, can I get to the floating island right now? I remember I had this problem before. Can I even get to the floating island? Oh, I screwed it. I should go and find out, but first I should do this. I gotta tell myself that, like, leaving the stage is fine, because, like, we were going... Like, if we were playing the original, we'd have to leave every star anyway. I'm just so sick of being on Bob on Battlefield. I assumed that, uh, that permadeath run would last much longer than it actually did. I didn't account for, like, f uh, not fall damage, but, like, falling into the void and just being insta-killed. Which almost makes me happy I didn't make it to TikTok Clock, because that would have been a- Oh, come on. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, but no, that makes me happy that we didn't make it to TikTok Clock, because I would have definitely lost there if I didn't already lose it. I didn't know you take damage running into him. I never knew that. Huh. You learn something new every day. With Mirror Mario 64. But no, yeah, I love uh, playing games in like a mirrored format like this. It's very fun and interesting. I think after this star, we take a break from B.O.B. And we go do some Womps. Because I can, I can accomplish Womps in one go. Like, I know that's doable. Like, off the top of my head. Because uh, getting to the floating islands would be the hard part. And, like, I know you can get there in that stage without the bridge that you'd need. Normally. But no, yeah, there we go. There's another star for you. Uh, does that update anything? Any updaters in chat? Yo, update ma? Come on, come on. No, you were so close. Mario, you almost had it. Bastard. And cancel my fall damage. Oh my god, he jumps down after me. Again, another thing that I've never bothered to try. Let me guess, you're not going to open these cannons for me, are you? No, okay, because the cannon's already open and in use. All right. Let's go do some womps and then we'll come back, because I, I don't want to be stuck doing this forever. Let's go see if womps has a new palette, actually. Because again, it's sort of lacking in the changed color palette department. I'm not seeing a whole lot of those changes implemented. Chip off womps block. Again, no color palette changes, huh? This time I've got it for sure. <laughs> twice! It happened twice in a row, are you kidding? Oh wait, you can't get Womps in one go. You've gotta get the... You gotta get the tower star, and I can't get the tower star if there is no tower to get it on. Also, blast away the wall if the cannons won't open won't be- or will technically be doable, but like, I- I never learned the trick for that. Again, I'm not a speedrunner or anything. What?! I bonked. I did not mean to bonk like that. The void takes another. Maybe it'd be best to go up and around, like I usually do. Well, I don't think I've ever had this much trouble out of Womp's Fortress. Can I blame it on the fact that I'm streaming? Can I blame Streamer Brain for me being bad at this level right now? Will that be accepted? I hope so. Boy, do I ever hope so. This is a pretty easy 100 coins, so I'll probably shoot for 100 coins here. Just again, because it is so easy. 
Come on. Yeah. Give me the give me the box. Thank you. And boink. Boink. Got it. One down. That's the easy one. But no, there's so many more coins than a hundred in this stage that like you'd be a miss not to get the hundred coins. Oh, the numbers are flipped as well. That's funny. Like if you get any hundred coin star in this game, it's gotta be this one. Just cause it's so easy just to knock this one out. Ah, God. Why do you need to be so tough to stand on? Do you have to be that way? Come on, man. You don't have to get all slippery with me. Cause like, especially because of all the piranha plants. That, those are just free coins. All right, four. Let's get this red. And I'll get this blue coin here. Like, you can't... Actually, the Big Boo's Haunt one might be easier because of all the ghosts. I'm not sure, but I don't, I don't like Big Boo's Haunt as a stage as much as I like this stage, so... You know, that's definitely part of my bias. You can see the star through the seam in the world, but I can't get it. Oh, what a shame. Okay, don't fall over. Don't fall over. Yep. Perfect. Alright, we just needed to stick around for one rotation. And then we go back. Like, we're already at 75 and I haven't even seen the whole level yet. Ah, oh, what did I just say about falling over? What did I just say? Not two seconds ago. Let's do this the fun way. Ow, oh, well. So much for doing it the fun way. No, okay, I thought I was going to slip all the way back down. That would have been very funny for trying to do. That's that's another thing. That's another gambit that catches me in this game a lot is just um gosh, the stage looks so weird like this. Uh but like that's another gambit that gets me in this game uh of just like trying to do cool tricks and like trying to do some sick uh sh movement and then like not being capable. And then these guys give you five coins, I think, if I remember right. There we go. Got my keys mixed up. Yeah, I think it's like five. Perfect, perfect. It's 87. All right, let's get a star, shall we? Just to get this guy out of the way. Some people like to use him as a platform to get over to the floating islands early, but I'm here to tell you, you don't need to do that at all. Like, not in the slightest do you need to do that. You know, I never understand, uh, the, like, sometimes I don't get, like, uh, the renders for Mario 64, the 3D renders, uh, as compared to, like, Mario in-game. Like, it just doesn't work for me. But, like, occasionally I'll catch this Mario model at a certain angle and I'll go, Yeah, I could see what they were going for there. Like, I, I see I see where the connection is. Oh, come on. Like, that art direction is definitely visible in the game. It's just only at certain points. Uh, seven. And then eight is right over there. I love calling this star red coins of the floating isle. Well, not the star I'm on, but the star I'm doing currently. Uh, calling it red coins of the floating isle. Despite only two coins. Count them. Two coins being on floating islands. It is a cool star name, though. So, can I really fault them for it at the end of the day? Okay. Even the star text is flipped? Yeah. Love that. Don't love that. Look before you leap. 
Look before you leap. Oh my goodness. Jeez, we've been live an hour. Already. This will be a quickie. Uh, I can go ahead and get all the red coins. Because the red coin thing is the last thing I have to get. Right? Oh, wait, is there a tower now? There should be tower now. We can get tower star. We were going to have to come back anyway. Okay. Well. You know. So much for that. Yeah, we're just going to go up and around, I think. That'll be so much easier just to... Jump up and come around. Yeah, get him. Dunzo. Clean, clean. Not even gonna get the blue coin. Not even gonna bother. That's how swag I am. That's the level of swag that I possess. A, sl a swag the likes of which you could not even imagine. This rat is swagged out. Let's go. You like how close I hit that turn? Yeah. I'm gaming. I'm getting too confident in myself. Something terrible is going to happen at any moment. I think Owl exists now. Oh god, Bullet Bill. I always found Bullet Bill to be fucking like terrifying in this game. For the whole one time that he appears. No! <laughs> Please! Oh yeah, that's right. I could actually be collecting one-ups this playthrough. Because they'll actually, like, mean something. Mario is impatient and does not want to wait on the elevator. Alright. Let's see, what else we got? We gotta get the last of our red coins, which should be just those over there, yes? Well, not like that we don't. Oh, I missed this one. How did I miss this one? I walked right by it. And then we're missing one down there, but I wanna go ahead and run up and get this one if I can. Just for simplicity's sake. I could long jump that, but I'm not sure. Again, with these controls, where crouch is placed, I'm not sure that's viable. What the fuck? Was I just Odyssey rolling? I was! That's neat. I forgot I turned that on. I didn't know the key combo for that either. Till just now. I mean, I know it in Odyssey, of course. That's not what I wanted to do. I just wanted a long jump, my guy. But I went for the right click instead of the left click. So enjoy this walk up on repeat. Until we eventually get up there. I love the, f like, very, like, jarring fade-in of uh, Piranha Plant Lullaby. What an innocent little sleepy song. I feel like this game really marks how cartoony Mario is. Like, all the time. Yeah, we made it. Leave me alone, Bullet Bill. God. Leave me out of this. I don't know what beef you've got. But I don't want anything to do with it. Again, I'm just getting the stars that I can get. Just, you know, while I can get them. I mean, this should be the last coin that we have to get. Dunzo. I'm probably going to skip out on uh, Cage Star because I don't know Owlless and uh, I don't want to come back into this stage again just to get the owl to unlock. Unless they put the owl in by default. I could check. I could check. I also don't know how I'm going to control the owl like this. I can barely do it in base game. But we could try. But I don't think he's available on Star 2. He is not available on Star 2. Okay, there we go then. This Terraria mod gameplay is funky. Is my category set to Terraria right now? Am I in Terraria? 
No, surely not. Give me OBS. Mario 64, yeah. Okay, good. All right, I, I was I was afraid I screwed up my Twitch categories again. Somehow. Uh, we're up to seven stars. All right. We'll be able to knock out a few here. I do this joke with all my friends. Oh, I see. Always oh, say the wrong game. Gotcha. It's a funny bit. I do this I do this bit occasionally as well. I'm a connoisseur of being incorrect. Slip sliding away? Eh, are we gonna start with the slide here? Oh god, I forgot about the mirror and the two seconds it took to load this level. Yet yeah, no, there are no changed color palettes here. Don't seem to have any changed color palettes. No color palette enjoyer here. Uh oh. That's the wrong side of the mountain, bud. Well. That penguin is lost to time. How am I doing this? How the heck was I navigating that? Alright, we'll try for 100 coins here, too. Why not? It'll be easy. It'll be fun. It'll be just a simple little 100 coin romp. Kind of like how I drop fun facts, uh, like how in Mario 64, you can chain triple backflip into a, f into a flood hover. What do you mean a flood hover? Where do you see this flood? <laughs> No, just the idea of, like, me reading that and going, Oh, no, yeah, this, wait, I, I'd love to learn a cool move in Mario 64. And then it's like, oh. Oh, this is a sunshine tip you're throwing at me. I want to play sunshine on stream so bad, but I just, I did a recent playthrough on my own of sunshine. Uh, semi-recently. So I don't, I don't want to, like, you know, keep replaying sunshine over and over. You know, the flood, the thing on his back right now, at this very moment. Give me that chaser blue coin. Oh, I jumped too early. Oh, no. Well, there we go. Into the, like, four pixels on that wall texture. Okay. Note to self, slide first. You got it. Didn't manage to get a single star yet. Okay. I'll go ahead and get you. Just because you're in the way. Oh, come on, I couldn't get that top coin. Oh, well. But no, yeah, if there's, like, chat interest in a Sunshine playthrough, I'd totally be down. Because, like, I want to, I just haven't yet. Come on, come on, aim for the right. Okay, it's too far to the left. No way we're doing that. Oh, yeah, this is mirrored as well. So that might also be why my muscle memory is a little screwy on this. We're gonna keep cracking. We're gonna get this eventually. I won't not get it. I might have to take the secret route just to get this first one and then come back for the... Because I'm going to have to come back into the level for the penguin anyway. I almost dived into this. I don't want to dive in. That is what the kids would call a bad fucking idea. No! Oh, come on. Oh, come on, I didn't fall for it the first time. Oh, oh I just looped back around and got me. All right, all right, all right. Back in. Here, let me let me have a Google real quick to see if I can get these custom, uh, see if I can get these custom things working, you know? Because I'd love to be able to do that. Uh, to get the custom uh, Encore mode layouts for the levels. SM64 plus. Okay, fine. I won't do it on my phone. I, I don't know what the deal is recently, but Android has had this issue for me of just, like, not ever... Like, I'll be mid-typing a thing, and then I'll hit a part of my screen, and it'll just stop typing. A part of my screen on the keyboard, mind you, and it'll just go, No. You're done typing now, and it'll take the keyboard away and exit out of the of the uh, text box I was putting text into. And usually that erases all the text that I put in. 
uh, Mario 64 plus Encore mode. Let's see. Let's look at photos of it working and because like they were advertising it as the Bowser stages in like the trailer for this, and I assume that was just because Bowser stage, you know. Huh? Maybe so. I see no difference here. I mean, the lighting is different. And because it's not fully implemented yet. Huh. Okay. Oh, well. Sounds like touch screen or water damage. I, I haven't had my phone anywhere near water. It's, it's, it's like, it's a feature issue, I think, of some, like, it's, it's something I'm hitting that I'm not realizing I'm hitting. Like, there might, there's like a keyboard down button on it, I think, that I'm mashing, that I'm not meaning to. This is the wrong side. You need to be over here. I'm going to avoid uh, JRB like the plague. I don't want to go to Jolly Roger Bay. I don't want to do that to myself. So I'm just not gonna. Could I, I, I gotta I gotta do like a normal Mario 64 playthrough at some point as well. I wanted to do Odyssey on stream. I very much wanted to do Odyssey on stream. And I would have like a few months ago started that playthrough. So it's easy to get a capture out of my Switch. Um, like, I'm, it's easy to get a video out of my Switch because it's just a normal HDMI, so I'm able to just pump it through. Uh, but... You... This is easier on a joystick. Hey, that's one way to do it. Okay, I'm going down backwards, huh? I don't know if you can do this backwards. Like, I'm not sure that that's entirely the most doable thing in the world. Yeah, it's doable. I just messed it up. But no, yeah, it's definitely me hitting a button. Because if it were, like, touchscreen damage, I feel like I definitely have more issues than that. So, like, I doubt that that's the issue here. Okay, I'll take, a, I'll take another crack at it. And then if I can't get it, then I'll, uh... If I can't get it in this attempt, then I will go and uh, do another star in this level. And then come back to this. Because I'm going to do this. Like, this is essential for 100, 100 coins if I decide to do 100 coins for this stage. Which I kind of already have. Um, God, this camera makes it very, very difficult to do anything. Like, for these slide levels, it makes it super difficult. Maybe I'd be good at the other slide? I don't know. I'll, uh, I'll come back to it. I'll come back to it. It's not tied to the red coins, though, so I'm gonna go ahead and get those. Yeah. Alright, give me this guy. Not that side of the mountain, but this side. We're going for a little trip, bud. We're going down. We're going all the way down. Oh no, oh no, we really are going all the way down. Oh, I almost made it to the platform too. Okay. Oh, that canceled out the audio. I didn't mean to do that. All right, trying again. Let's, uh, my game plan is to do you first. Oh my god, I almost landed back in the thing. How do you do that? Took a dive as well? The game seems to be gravitating me towards that. Give me the- Give me the penguin! What am I doing? 
I'm getting very bad at the game right now. It's it's the ice in here, I think, and like obviously the mirror affecting my like muscle memory of this. See, to keep the analogy going from earlier, this now has become like riding a bike in reverse. Oh. All right. Oh my God, what are you doing? I mean, I'm glad you're not getting away, but like. Give me that penguin. Penguin try to not be in the most unreachable spot in the level challenge. Impossible edition. Okay, I think from here we need to make our way over this bridge. I mean, we don't need to. We can always just slide down. But, like, honestly, with the day I'm having, do you expect me to be able to do that? I can barely do that in the normal game. That's another trick that I can just barely pull off normally. Do I tempt fate? I do. And I didn't fall off, but, uh... You know, an equally bad thing happened. Here's your child, express delivered from the top of this mountain. Take it. There, you're not sad anymore. Great. Give me the star. All right. And as per usual, the trend must continue. Blood for blood. No, come here. Blood for blood. Be mad about it. Cry about it even. Okay, red coin romp then. Need to go up. I think it was actually, speaking of, like, uh, alliteration, I think it was this game that gave me my love of, like, alliterative titles for missions in games. And, like, coming up with them. <laughs> the viewer count went down by one while I was doing that. Like, right after I dropped the baby penguin down, like, between now and then, the view count has gone down by one. It's hilarious that somebody saw me do that and went, Oh, well, no, that's just not right. And then left. I'm not sure if I want to go for 100 coins, because I, if I can... Oh, I'm so close to being able to do that. I'm so used to the DS version where you can get Luigi's, like, twirl move and do it that way. I guess I'm not going for 100 coins, by the way. Um... We'll see if we can manage this mission now. This level... Oh, man. This is a lot harder. Or this uh, this mode is a lot harder than I thought it would be. Because I was like... I was just rolling through earlier when we weren't mirrored. Okay, take it nice and easy. Nice and easy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good now. We're like on the home stretch at this point. Yump. And then we can just leave. And that'll give us the star for that. Yahoo. I mean, we didn't get all the coins in there, but we got a bunch of the coins in there. I think we may have gotten enough even to to warrant, you know, going for 100 coin. At the very least, let's get the eight reds. I think here's good enough. Here is good enough. Yeah, yeah. So so what's going on, chat? How are your how's your day going? How are your collective days going? Already delivered baby penguin. Don't need to do that again. Deliver him like a pizza. Straight to the front door. Missing the obvious joke of delivering him, you know, like a baby. How did I save that? How did I just manage to save that? That doesn't feel like it should have been possible. Alright, I don't remember where these spawn, so I might very well miss out. I think it's up and down. Yeah? Oh no, it's just the two. 
Actually, no, there's more over here, I think, right? This leads around the corner to... I don't know, this is where the red coin star spawns. Uh, how many red coins are we up to? Three? Okay. Because that one would make four, but I want to get that last, obviously. There's... There's four! Yeah, we're up to 57 coins. This will be fine. We can do... We can do... 100 coin from here. Yeah, come at me. Yeah, come at me. Have at me. Boing! Uh-oh. Didn't want to miss that one. Let's, uh, let's go get that coin box over there. That feels like the move. Oh! Oh! It's not a coin box. It's, uh, this one's the one-up. There is another box here that is coinage. That we could probably get. How long can I green demon like this? I don't know if that was one of the chaser ones or not. There is a green demon mode for this, though, that I want to check out. Well, if this is any indication, then I'm not going to do very well. Oh, another game over. We're at, what, two game overs now? For this run? Not that I'm trying to go particularly fast, but hey, we're up to nine stars. We can go and check out the Bowser course and see if the Bowser course is any different. Skill issue. L plus ratio. Uh, let's go and do the uh, slide. Let's go do the slide. I want to do the slide. I want a change of pace. I want to go underground and do those stars. So it's mirrored, so it should be this one, yeah? Yeah. That's what we like to see. Oh god, and it turns this way now, because mirror. That means jumping off this way is a straight jump into the void. Yeah, it would be, wouldn't it? Alright. Yeah, the usual way is, is mirrored to get the under 20 seconds. I'll take another stab at it, though. Oh, I shouldn't have gone down this way. I have less control this way. Most importantly, I can't jump, so then I can't take another stab at it. Physically impossible to take another stab at it. Oh, this looks so weird now. 22? Oh. Probably like two seconds faster than I could probably do that normally. I, I always wondered if the, like, 20 second star, under 20 second star for this mission is, oh yeah, it doesn't take me out, I'm gonna have to exit course on my own. Uh, ooh, we can unlock wing cap real quick. Yo, wing cap enjoyer. Fun fact, I've never done this 8 reds wing cap star. Not once. And it looks like I'm not doing it today, either. There we are. See if we can figure out wing cap like this. Oh, this is so much harder to do than normal wing cap. Yeah, we're not doing this. No way I'm doing this, dude. Okay, let's see if Bowser course is different real quick. Real quick. We'll see. We'll see. I might scoot over to doing some portal maps at some point. Once I get bored of Mario 64. I think I might. No, this is no different either. Alright, let's see. I suck at doing eight reds here anyway. For that exact reason. Because that placement is just mean. It's just mean. At the end of the day. Let's see here. Oh, 
I was really hoping that the different, uh, the different aesthetics would pop in, you know? Could it be the graphics setting that I have it set to? Messing that up somehow? Maybe if I default that, then it'll work. Wow. Very good of me. Here, real quick. Let me find out if this works. And then if it does work, then, you know. I'll turn it on bilinear, which is what it was on by default. Okay, there we go. That's the only guess that I have is the graphics setting being weird. But even then, I don't really... Oh shoot, I don't want to resize this window any. No, stop trying to resize the window and just move it. Thank you. Alright, let's see. Ten stars. Ah, here we go. That fixed it. Oh, this is neat looking. Alright, well, you know what we gotta do now. Now we gotta go back to B.O.B. The old Crystal Palace, you know. And the castle interior is a lot cooler colored. As in, like, the color palette is cooler instead of warmer. Oh, wow. This feels much more natural with the blurry textures and whatnot. Foot race with Koopa the Quick. Did I not get the Koopa the Quick star? This is different. This feels like autumn-y almost. I can't believe it was just because I had it on nearest neighbor. I had an inkling because that it would cause a problem somehow because nearest neighbor was in red. And so I didn't know... And, and I didn't know why it was in red, but it was. And I was like, oh no, is this going to be an issue? They made the castle cooler. They made this warmer and more orange. Come on. Could have swear we got this, uh, this uh, I almost said this shine. I, I could have swear we got this star in this mission. Or in this run at some point. I know we got it in the, uh, in the permadeath sequence that we did there. But, uh, see if my time is better or worse, because I don't, I don't remember exactly what my time was the first time. But I'm, I'm betting it's going to be worse, because I'm going to keep making mistakes like that. 56 seconds. <laughs> All right, come on, Cooper the Quick. I hear your footsteps. I know you're coming. I can smell you. Here he comes, slow as ever. Give me my star. Give me my star. Okay, what other stars are we missing here? I think we just couldn't get to the floating island was part of the problem. In terms of doing the first star. Heck yeah, hit that slope. Slope gaming. Oh, we got wing cap here now. Great, great, great. I don't think I went for 100 coins just because uh, we had just spent so much time in B.O.B. So let's keep running around B.O.B. with different aesthetics for just a minute or two. See if we can get that nice, slick 100 coin star. That slick, wet, warm, juicy, delicious 100 coin star. No, not into the cannon hole! No! Well, Mario went in first. I'm gonna just shoot straight up so that I come down around the same spot. It burst! Are you kidding? It burst! Where did it burst? It burst over there? 
Come on, I can at least get a couple of the coins out of it. Yeah, okay. Hey, I got them all. Neat. All right, let's uh, keep knocking around here. But no, yeah, if there's interest in these games, I'd totally be down to do, like, full earnest playthroughs of them in, like, the regular streams. I gotta update my stream. Uh, I gotta update my stream schedule on Twitch, because it still says I stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And now it's Monday, Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, and it's still, it still says, I believe it still says that on Wednesday I'm playing Opposing Force. Every Wednesday. It's, uh, I'm very much not playing Opposing Force every Wednesday anymore. There we are. Oh no, I don't have my friendly little guide anymore. I could probably line it up vaguely on this. Yeah, would you look at me? Would you just look at that? Oh my goodness. Look how much progress we've made. Progress. Uh, so instead of trying to get the thing, I'm just going to get as many coins as possible. I think aiming right here would get me as many coins as possible. And it got me, like, three of the actual coins for the thing, too. Six. Which means we just need seven. And eight. Let's see. Seven. Yo, coin? Yo, coinma? Oh my god, he escaped. That coin's going places. He's got, he's got stuff to do. He's got people to see. I can't go bothering him. Oh my god, I can't keep chasing coins out into traffic like a toddler after a butterfly. Heck yeah, 40 coins. We're about to near up on 50. Give me that. I'll be having this. All right, I don't know which red coins we're missing anymore. But we're going to we're going to go and find out which red coins we're missing by way of wandering this level until we do. Hey, you know. That's something. There's a bunch of coins halfway up here that we've gotten a couple times through a couple of these runs. So let's uh, grab those real quick. And then keep moving. I'm starting to get B.O.B. fatigued. B.O. fatigue. Uh, which red coins could I possibly be missing at this point? I don't think I grabbed the Chain Chomp one, and I don't think I grabbed the other one at the start of the stage. Give me the tree, thank you. You get right up to this edge and jump, jump. Okay, let's not jump too close in an effort to get one coin. I want to get these sky coins as quick as possible though because I don't want to end up with the predicament of having the 100 coin star spawn in the sky. Okay, let's head back this way and get the coins. Just gotta grab this from you real quick there, buddy. Oh, we only missed one. We we're just missing the one, okay. Well, let's see then. Let's go over here and grab this here star. Over yonder. So we'll be at like 87 coins after we... Wait, hold on. We might be able to make it a clean 90. 69. Nice. We'll be at 87 by the time we get these poles because they drop five each. Yes. Believe so. Believe so. Then 
this doesn't look all this different all that different to me because I used to have a I used to play this game on a really shitty uh, LCD TV and so the color the it was like very weirdly color balanced and so the colors would always look fucked like this not quite as cleanly fucked as this but like definitely up there you know uh, let's get in this cannon, sure. I don't see why not. I don't think we're getting that from here. I'll level with you. I really, really don't. We could try, though. Okay, that was a solid effort. 83. We should have gotten 87. Did I get all four poles? I'm not sure I even got all four poles. Time to run around poles like an idiot again. I think I walked off before I got the poles. Is what I think. Oh, did I get the poles earlier? Was it just this pole, or did I get them all? Time to find out. Hey, I did miss out on a couple. I definitely got that pole, but... I don't think I got the other three. 94. This might bump me over the edge, because I don't know if it's five or six, but it's definitely a few coins. Did I get two? I think I might have gotten this one, too. Either that or I just keep screwing up. No, yeah, I got it. Okay. 96. All right. Well, time to suffer. Because unless we can get these little fellas to drop me six coins... But I think I've killed enough of them that, like, I won't be able to get those six out of them. Sadly. I don't know if there are six more in the stage that have a coin in them. There might just be. There might just be. Potentially. The potential is out there for there to be a coin inside of these enough to matter anyhow i know there's that one that mans that cannon up there that like if i really wanted to get him i could okay i've already dealt with the ones that are down in the valley which is why i'm coming right back down here anyway because i'm just that gamer definitely an intentional choice by the the mario 64 king 97. 98. 98, 98, 98, 98, 98. Where's 98? Uh, have I killed you yet? Are you my 98th coin? You're not. Okay. Well, off to the skies I go. I hate to give up two coins left, but like... Yeesh, it's looking tight. Right there. Yeah, I've gotten pretty consistent at that again. So that's good. Let's see if we can knock out these last few coins we need for 100 coin. Along with maybe collecting those. I think lining this up with the second Sky Ridge was how I got that last time, yes? Yes, it was. Oh, good. Now I have to find a way to get that. Suppose everything in time. Everything in time. Let's go. Let's go. Teleport pog. Telepog. Okay, I kind of just felt it out that time. I didn't bother with, like, actually doing the thing. But I definitely should have bothered with actually doing the thing. Okay, right there. And then grab the tree. And then fall down. And then I want to go for the star. But if I don't hit the star, I'll probably hit the coin that I need. Okay. 
Right there should do. Dang it. Not quite, not quite. Okay, let's try again. There's a star on the line here, people. I'm not gonna give it up. 100 coin star at that. That's a very hard star to acquire. Or a very time-consuming star to acquire, rather. That's why I didn't want to do this immediately. Uh, that's why I wanted to get the air stuff out of the way immediately, but then I, I didn't. Because I was like, oh, there's probably enough coins on the ground that I could just do this. Yeah, why not? And then, you know, of course there are not. If I get the wing cap, maybe that'll help me out here. I'm not sure. Something tells me that's going to be a firm no. But, uh, hey, whoever said I couldn't try. Come on. And then we swing back around and get it. And then we swing back around and get it. Oh, come on. Get that coin. No? Okay. No, I can't die right now. No, 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 no. Oh, everything is so scary right now. Everything is very frightening. Okay, I'm on the safe-ish part of the level. That's why the ish. <laughs> okay. Into the cannon we go. Oh, boy. Okay. Let's get up and out. Let's do that in an effort to at least get that coin that we need. We got the coin that we needed. That's good. So now we're up to what? Four of those, I think? Believe four. I believe we needed four of those. God, I haven't seen everything this mod has to offer, and I doubt I will today. Okay, in we go. I want to mostly focus on the first floor stuff. And just seeing all that. Uh, where is that last coin? I'm not sure. What I am sure of, though, is that I want to get that star. Come on! That was so close. You can't just let me have it. For that for free come on please honestly I might get the hundred coin star and say fuck the other star who cares you know again that's why the cannonballs here suck wait are they actual 3d objects huh I always assumed they were like every other spherical object in the game a texture but it was, it was moving in a weird way. So, like, maybe... Maybe it's a 3D object. Or maybe that's something the PC port does. Let's try it like that. That was it. Yep. Alright, I'll give it the old college try. I'll get back over there. Now that I'm back over here. Oh my god, did you see his back move like that? Gonna get whiplash, Mario. Um, but now that I'm back over here, I should be able to do one of these. And give this old, uh, this coin a couple more shots. And see, just see if I can do it with this last shot. Eh? Maybe a couple more. Maybe. Which coin even is it? Is it that one? I think it's that one, yeah. Come on. Grab it! Yeah! With one shot, I managed to get it. Exactly on mark. Hey! And I landed directly onto the star. That's Bob on Battlefield complete, ladies and gentlemen. We've done it.
We've done it, we've done it, we've done it. Oh man, I forgot how blue the castle is. That would be double die. Um Let's go see Womps. I just wanna have a look at Womps like this. I I think we've gotten all the stars in Womps. But I wanna see it like this. You know, I wanna at least give it a look. Fall into the caged island. Oh right, we didn't get cage stuff. Oh, it's pink in here. It's slightly pinker. Uh these are these these alt versions of the stages are neat. They just feel like like this feels like I'm just playing this level but during sunset which I guess is cool in its own way all right now to figure out controlling the owl especially since I can't look where I'm going how did I do that how did I manage that no hold on hold on how did what I'm so gamer. You can't even imagine the levels of gaming that I'm on. Somebody clipped that. Oh my god. Oh my god. How deep into the stream are we? An hour 40? I'm gonna go back and clip that if nobody does. Holy shit. I'm gaming. Never expected to be so gamer in my life. Uh, I got the 100 coin star here. I'm missing a star, but I don't know which star. It oh, it's Blast Away the Wall. Oh, I know now. It's Yeah, it's Blast Away the Wall. 100%. That's fine. I can knock that one out. Oh, wrong way. Forget that we're mirrored again. Open the cannon, please. You, open the cannon. Don't make me, uh... Don't make me blast you. With this cannon you're about to open for me? Huh. Alright. Wait. Okay, so it's that wall, yes? While we're mirrored here? Okay. So here's the game plan. If I try and go up there, or if I try and shoot up there, I'm definitely gonna overshoot, and I'm gonna land myself in the void. So let's not overshoot it, or let's not even attempt to shoot it, and instead just come over here like this, and just sort of slip down onto it. Got it, got it. Oh, I can't leave right now because I'm on a thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's all the stars we've got. Now we just went back and polished off that. I want to give the secret slide another shot. I want to see what they've done to the secret slide. So we got the main star in the secret slide, but I don't think we got the, uh... Again, just kind of pale. We didn't get the under 20 seconds one. And so I want to... Yump. Come on, come on. Oh, I was so close. I was so close. I should have been more confident. I should have held forward more. Let's try again. Let's try one more time. One more little attempt, please. Yeah, here we are. And then, yump. I didn't quite get the distance out of that yump that I would have liked, but come on, get up, Mario. Mario, get up. Mario, wake up, please. 18. Would you look at that? 18. Oh, is it just like a filter on the screen? No, because Mario looks normal. Alright, so we got both the stars here now. I'm doing so much better on this, like, return visit thing. Let's see if I can ruin that by, uh, going back to, uh, I almost said shifting snow land. Uh, back to Cool Cool Mountain. Big penguin race, baby. Oh, it's very blue up here now. I like the blue in this level. Let's get our big penguin race on, shall we? See if we can knock him out. That's what I always thought was very unfair about the big penguin race, is that the penguin gets to go ahead of you. So I always try, like, usually I try to, like, skirt around the penguin. You know? 
Like, I usually try to... I can't go that fast, Penguin. I'm gonna... I'm gonna fall off! Yeah. But no, yeah, but I usually try to get, like, behind the Penguin and then talk to her. And do it that way. I say talk to her as though, like, this is the same... I mean, it's the same Penguin model. But, like, I don't know if it's the same Penguin, necessarily. I always like to think that it's, like, the father penguin, maybe. It's a big thought. But, like, occasionally I just go, ah, it's just the same penguin. And don't worry about it. You know? I threw a kid off a mountain and now she wants revenge. Alright, I don't know if that was a close enough shot for her to consider it cheating. Because, again, like Koopa the Quick, and the world may never know. Like Koopa the Quick, she's got a thing where if she detects that you, like, m skipped over a portion of the track... And, like, fell down onto it. That, like... You'll definitely, uh... That you definitely cheated 100% of the time. And will just, like, cancel the race star. So there we go. Now we're almost on even footing. Gosh, I gotta start doing a long jump there. Because sometimes I do a long jump and that gives me a nice head start. Yeah, I've gone too far. Alright, maybe that star is not for me. Uh, Snowman uh, lost his head would be a good star to do right now. But I don't think I want to try out more of these stars at the moment. I think I want to go and try something a little different. Like, uh, not Jolly Roger Bay. I'm avoiding Jolly Roger Bay like the fucking plague. Because it is a plague. I'll have to look at it before the end of the stream. I'll definitely have to look at it. Yeah, I think I'm going to stream just this, actually. Oh, what was that? That was a new sound. The pch Right? Am I, am I tripping? Or is that... Like, that's new. That hasn't always been there. Oh, I like the green that we've gone for here. The greens and very, like, bright purples for Bowser stages. They're always good. This is a changed stage element. Now every single one of these has one attached, usually. Oh, no, that last one doesn't. Okay. I thought it did. Oh, I thought it was hanging out outside of his line of fire. Come on, now. How did I mess that up? Yikes. Yikes! Yikes! Okay, I think we're good. Yikes! How did I manage to screw that up? Hey, Cherry MC, welcome in, welcome in. Thanks for the raid, by the way. Oh, wow, sorry, I completely missed that initially. But welcome in, welcome in. Thanks for the raid. Hi everyone, I'm Voxel64. I do some amazing things. Like, not Mario64 usually, actually, if you could believe it. Um, I'm usually like a Minecraft streamer. I'm, a, uh, I'm usually a uh, funny little guy on the internet. I play a little bit of Half-Life. I do some House Flipper, some Power Wash Sim. Ha uh, I almost said Half-Life twice, some Minecraft. I'm all over the place, really. But, uh, yeah, no. It's, it's going pretty well. The game itself is not going terribly well. I'm not I'm not bringing my A game today in particular. But uh no, yeah. We're doing well. How are you? How was stream? Always love to hear how stream has been going for anybody who raids. Oh, oh, oh. Again. One more time. Nice little shock to the system. Gets Mario going. He secretly enjoys it. Yo, Kinky Mario head cannon? <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's get up here. Gonna require a lot of focus as to not slip up. Ah, idiot! Get owned. Not too eventful, but kind of nice. Yeah, yeah. A boring stream can be fun sometimes. Something nice and simple is like a breather between the chaos, you know? 
All right, let's see if we can get some Bowser throws in with this weird uh, control scheme that we've got going on here. Oh, it's green. Nice little emerald platform, huh? All right, you'll hear no complaints from me. Very nice change of pace. Oh, went in a little too soon. Okay, time to mash WASD. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh, not quite. That's okay. We only need one throw here. Now he'll hit it. There we go. I had to do it the, the baby gamer way. But no, yeah, boring streams can be nice. A nice little chill time. Ba-ding. Get that key, Mario. Slurp it up. Put it under your hat, whatever you do with it. Alright, now we can go downstairs. I want to go see what other stages have been changed. Uh, how other stages have been changed in this little pack here. Because we should be able to do Big Boo's Haunt now, yes? Yes, yes we are. Also, I wonder if the courtyard looks like the castle grounds. Mario just eats the key. I don't blame him. It looks kind of tasty. Where is... Oh, 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 it's mirrored. I'm an idiot. All the stages are mirrored, and I'm, I'm being a fool about it. Ooh, I don't think I've ever landed that on the stair before. Usually it's just out in the field. Go on a ghost hunt. Oh, it's all in black and white! Oh, that's dope! I love that! That's such a cool aesthetic for this stage. Oh my goodness. Alright, time to go on a ghost hunt. As they say. By they, I mean the mission title. You gonna come over this way? No, despite being a ghost, you're still bound by the laws of, uh... Oh my goodness. How am I alive? Ghosts don't die, yada yada, backwards text. See, now I don't feel bad skipping over text boxes in this game like I usually do, because most of the text boxes... Gotta get used to that ground pound placement. This is the stage to get used to it, if there ever was one. Oh boy. But no, yeah, ghosts don't die, whatever. They always give you the same text box. But anyway, what I was saying was, I'm, I'm glad that, like, the text, skipping over text boxes isn't as big of a deal anymore. Right now, just because, like, now they're in reverse. And so, like, how am I supposed to even read it if I wanted to? I don't think I've read most of the text in Mario 64. I just skip the text boxes so often that, like, I haven't actually taken a good read of it. Okay, we're gonna get hit with some stuff here. I think this stage will probably be one of the better ones as far as being able to... Uh, being able to, like, play it in one go goes, anyway. Come on. Come in. I guess it's not all black and white, but, like, it's close. Oh, are you kidding? Did I really just do that? I'm a fool. Hello, yes, I am fool. There are only two in there, yeah? Yeah, I think so. Weird, they didn't give me the text. I think the text cancels, maybe, in this version? I don't know. Hi, Piano. I'm gonna take your, uh, red coin and run for my life, please. Ah, yes. Okay, that worked. Because the reason I say that about it being a good continual stage is because now I should be able to just knock this guy clean out. And the stars are gray. Let me position myself here. It's because this happens and gives you access to the second floor. And that's always fun. Uh, let's see. Do you got a red coin in here? I think you got a couple in here, actually. Raise them up. Oh, red coin under there. Ah. Oh my goodness. How did- Oh my goodness. How did that happen? Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Like, you're saying you wouldn't put that key in your mouth? Like, really? Do you think you're fooling anybody with that? 
I'm not fooled, personally. That's seven. Where's the eighth red coin? I don't know my red coins for this stage as well as I know every, everywhere else. Let's see, let's see. I'm trying to figure this out. So we've gone in all these doors, yeah? How about these over here? No, no, I have not gone over here. Oh, look at me go. I think it's, uh... I think it's top model, oh, top, bottom, middle. No, not that. I'm gonna take that one out first. Top, bottom, middle. And then this will get out of my way. I eat it a key. Yum. Fantastic. Fantastic. My voice is cracking. I haven't had anything to drink in a bit. I should hydrate. I will hydrate momentarily. Uh, I can always hydra hydrate during the BRB. Okay, that's where that other door goes. I don't think I've... Oh, no, it's in this, like, graded room. I remember. This is where the other red coin goes. Well, time to climb back. Getting over it in Luigi's Mansion. Uh, this room was the graded room, I think. Yep. Okay. There we are. And then the red coin star. And that's three for three so far. I don't know if we can do Big Boo's balcony or Big uh, King Boo's merry-go-round in this one. I might have to load those specific missions to get the things for those. Not completely certain. I think, I think he's just chilling up there at all times though, yeah? Oh, that's something I've never seen before. Because you never get to see this place from that perspective. You always view it from, like, this side. That there's a boo painting there. Huh. Funny. Funny how that works. Uh, let's see. I think the door to get over there is the one over here. Yeah. I don't know my door placements anymore. Because, uh... Because of the mirroring. It's completely screwed me over. Yeah, we'll just blame the mirror. That works. I don't think I'm going to be coming back up here anytime soon. So I should probably just go ahead and get these. There we are. Or at least on this attempt, because I'm going to need the uh, invisible... Uh, the invisible cap to get back uh, through there to get the eye. And so... Speaking of eyes, I got to go kill the eye soon. You're not going to come after me. Dunzo, right? Did he get stuck? He got stuck! I can't believe he got stuck. Wow. Okay, they make doing this a little easier in this version. And changing the camera angle a little easier, so he should be able to just grab this with barely any sweat. There we go. Four for four. Wendy's. Let's go. Yo, chicken tendies. Let's go. Oh, no, it's a one-up box. It's not a... Ba-boom. And now we're going to take out these scuttle bugs. Poor little guys. I like scuttle bugs a lot, honestly. Hey, ten coin box. Very rare that we'll see one of those. Very rare thing for there to be a ten coin box. I hear constant boo noises, and I don't know where they're from. I think they're just the stage making those noises, but I don't think I've ever noticed the stage doing that. Might be part of the encore mode? I want to say it's not. I want to say that it didn't mention anything about changing the sounds. But, like, it very well could have. One of these shifting sand land boxes. Brings us up to 85. And there should be an eye in here with a blue coin, yes. Dead. Dead as they come. 90. Uh, I think there are coins down here, yes. Wow. Down we go.
And straight through here. Ah, nice little carnival music. Nice, creepy. Not very subtle at all, carnival music. Let's see if we can get Big Boo's merry-go-round this run. Because I think we, I think this might be another one we have to run back through for. I think this is the fire one, yeah? There are no boos here. We're supposed to be taking out boos. Where, where do they spawn, though? They spawn in one of these, yeah? Oh. Let's get out. Let's skedaddle. I didn't even take a glance over on this side. I think there might be something on this side, or maybe that's just in the DS version. Yeah, it's just in the DS version. Cause it's one of those timed stars. Where, like, the switch is on the other side, and then the star is on that side. You gotta make the little run around as fast as possible and whatnot. It's a nice little star. I enjoy it. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yahoo. Bing, bing. Bing bing wahoo. Let's go. Right up in here. Alrighty. And away we go. What do we got left here? I know there's another eye inside that we could get. As far as that's concerned. He's on the ground level and right in here. Yeah? Yeah, we got it. Come on. Oh, they tilted those. I think those are square in the original, no? Maybe not. 95, 95. That's fine. There's still one more eye lurking about, if I remember right. I mean, there's the one eye at the top, but... I don't want to take him out. No coins? Well, I guess this confirms what I said earlier about um, whether this stage or Womp's Fortress was easier in terms of blue, uh, in terms of the, is uh, another eye by the way. I think that'll be our last one, because blue coin. Yep, yep. Okay, now we're short two stars, and I think those two stars are the one we need, Invis Cap for, and Big Boo's uh, Merry-Go-Round. Which I would have to go separately for after I get the invis cap. So, we'll do that in a moment. We'll be doing that in just one moment. In the meantime, though, we're going to go to the BRB real fast. And we're going to... Uh, we're going to go to the BRB, and I'm going to run an ad real quick and grab a drink. I highly recommend you all do the same. Get a drink, get a snack, whatever you like. Uh, and I will be back in a moment with some more Mario 64. See you in a sec. Also, I'm going to run an ad if you don't want to see the ad. And you'd rather sit here with the Mario 64 music really nice in the background. Uh, you can always hit that sub button. Either way, though, I appreciate you. And I'll uh, be back in a moment. I'm back. I forgot to mute for just a, unmute for just a second. Uh, it's been 60 seconds, yeah. Like we're we're good to get back to this, right? Ads over. Hope so. Uh, anyway, let's uh let's get back into the stream real quick. Before we get back into it though, 
just to make sure these 60 seconds have officially passed. I just want to remind everyone, exclamation point Discord exists now, and that'll give you a link straight to the community Discord, uh, wherein you can, you know, post and uh, hang out with people in the community and get, you know, notifs for whenever I go live or post something on YouTube all in one place. You know, the usual. Also, you know, the follow button exists for those as well. But Twitch is a little iffy about its notifications, so I just want to make sure everybody knows. Anyway, got my drink. We should be getting back to the game now. Uh, isn't this music great, by the way? Anyway, uh, I feel like that was a very nice stopping point, because now we're moving on to the lower levels here. We're going into the basement areas. Getting things done. You know, you know how it is. Okay, let's see. Just for laughs. Let's go. Oh, nope, Toad is this way now. I'm so used to Toad being over on my left. Oh, Mips! Come on. Come on, give me Mips. Give me that rabbit. I'll be chasing this rabbit to the end of my days, man, I tell you. Which way is he gonna go? Which way is he gonna go? Oh, no, I didn't get him. No. I'm gonna jump into the fire any second now. In an effort to chase this dumb rabbit. <gasps> I'm in line with him. It's a very good spot to catch him, is in these two corners, with the one here and the one with Toad. Very, very easy to catch him that way. Come on. Come on. Okay. Alright, come on, Mips. Come on, buddy. Oh my god, the, the camera movement. That was automatic, I didn't do that. Oh, you little demon. Now I have to catch you. Now I have to get you. Cause now I've taken damage about it. I didn't come back and try again as many times as I like. So I might just have to start measuring my attempts at MIPS between stages. Except I won't be brought back here as easily. Oh well. We took fire damage, so I feel it appropriate to keep moving along here by going into Lethal Lava Land, which is very, very orange now. My goodness. I feel like this, um... I feel like this stage is a lot uh, better this way. Oh, well. Here I am talking about how great the stage is and dying instantly. I got my brain on MIPS! Give me that little man. Give him here. Yeah, how are you going to path around that one, idiot? Couldn't keep my mind off him. Another star. Yoink. What if I take my good friend Mips with me? Carry him like a little plush. Just walk him around. To Lethal Lava Land with ye. <laughs> I wonder if we'll still have him. I highly doubt it. No. Yeah, I didn't figure. That tracks. Oh, well. It's fine. Shut up, idiot. God. Okay, we're gonna work on our 100 coins. I don't know, this level's very secular. And so I'm not sure that we'll be able to get all the things we want to get in one go. Like, 100 coins I'm almost sure is possible. Because all the red coins are possible in one go here. And then there's enough coinage around that 
that, uh, like, there's so many coins just about in this level that, like, it's it's a very coin-abundant one. Oh, I almost got stuck. It's a very coin-abundant one, so I don't feel like we're going to be missing out or anything. And plus, we got bullies to kill. Not that I was ever any good at that. <laughs> Why do you make that noise? Can I knock him onto the puzzle? I just had the puzzle deal with him for me. He can't really handle these slopes. He's not good at it. Just keep him there. Just keep him right there. Yeah. Come on, is this puzzle piece gonna move or not? Or is he just gonna hang out here? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! Coin got delivered straight to me. Alright. What a winning strategy that was. Now to actually do it for real, because I doubt I'm gonna manage to get so lucky is that... Get this bully over here. I shouldn't go screwing with bullies while I have low health. That was a bad idea. I should have I should have backed away. I should have backed away to get more easy coins. But that's the thing is with the 100 coin star for this is measuring your coin grabs. And like tempering yourself so that you don't collect all the easy coins and then need more coins and it's like well what do I do now you know haha -ha, never let them know your next move can you get you back up onto your platform no oh well there was just no getting that Come on. Like, uh... The whole section with the thing being its own area. That's kind of... You know... Not the greatest. I feel like I'm better at dealing with bullies this way, which should tell you how bad I usually am at it. Then give me that one. Oh, well, that's just unfair. Oh, well, like I said, I'm pretty sure there are just enough red coins here. That I could, uh, get that. I don't want to go that way. I'll level with you. I really, really don't. Just because that way is, a like, 100%, just a lock-in of, well, now I'm doing this, you know. Okay, genius. Now, how do I get away from here? I know exactly how I get away from here. I don't like it very much. But it was my one and only option. Very slowly gathering these coins. Oh, that was a gambit and a half, and we worked it out. We completely did it. Okay, that was the last one. Uh, we got some bullies over here. I don't know if these are the bullies for the star, or if these are just guys hanging out. Just guys being dudes, you know? I'm unsure. Unschmerten. Yeah, one for one. Two for two. Alright. It only takes one skilled bully. One lucky bully, I guess. Because they're all equally skilled to get enough hits in on me. Because they can, like, stun lock you a little bit here. Which is the fear. Is that they're gonna, you know, stun lock me and I'm gonna be stuck. Oh, now we fight the big guy. Right. It's mostly the big guy's fault. The stun locking. Not that you'll get to see that because I am epic gamer mode today. Undefeatable, even. Two stars so far. Bully the bullies. Okay, now we need to get over there and fight that bully. So many of the missions in this uh, course rely on killing bullies. Uh, which is sort of odd, but I don't I don't know that I mind. It's like it's it's fine. I I'm, all right. Here's the here's the game plan. Since we're doing hundred coins, I'm definitely gonna go into the volcano this time, and then we're gonna have to make a second run round for the. Uh, 
We're gonna have to make a second run around specifically for the log rolling star. Because all the other stars are doable. In one run. But that one, I'm not sure about. I could probably do it if I really tried. Another star down, though. That's nice. Alright, let's see. Can I get gone here? I can, yeah. Okay. Oh, there are eight red coins reset. That'll help my 100 coin total by a long shot. Uh-oh. 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 Okay, that could have ended poorly. Oh, the puzzle completed itself, and that gives you coins as well. I forget. 65 coins so far. Let's see if we can increase that number dramatically by running around like this. If we had our shell, we'd be able to grab the rest of the coins here. But I'm afraid we don't have access to a shell at the moment. I think it unlocks itself at later missions. So again, we'll get that when we get log rolling. If we need to. Right, there's not like a shell box somewhere that I'm missing. Cause I swear it spawns on that like platform over there. But it only happens on like later missions, yes? Hey, I made it. Glad I could make it. Whoa, now. I don't want anything to do with that. We could probably go the long way around. We can indeed go the long way around and duck into here. Where there are most certainly 20 coins to be had. Are you kidding me? Absolutely there are 20 coins in here. I was worried I might not have the right amount coming in, but... Hmm. Just get to an elevated platform and he's done for. Again, the mirroring doesn't bother me as much anymore. It's still definitely causing me issues, but now I've adapted. Now I'm bigger, faster, and stronger too, but I am not, in fact, the first member of the DK crew. Okay, alright, we made it. We made it, we're fine. We're fine, we're okay. Let me grab this. And let me grab onto this, because I think... Oh god, are we going to be five coins short? We better not be five coins short. Do you know how annoying it would be to be five coins short of the hundred coin star? Like, if I get that coin off you, then that's fine. And then there should be some coins up this way. I think there's like one or two coins up here. There are in fact zero coins up here. Oh no 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 no, there are a couple. There are three. So that gives us four coins. Oh that's almost worse. Oh that's almost worse if we're gonna be one coin off. I definitely should have been more careful. Oh. Oh no, there are more coins. Okay. Alright, we're good. We're good. I was very scared for a sec, but I think we're good. You can jump from there to here, so I probably should have just gone up again. Ah, oh, darn. Let's, uh, get over here. This is where I fell last time. 99. 100. 100 coin star. Let's go. Right in the flame. Star is forged in fire. All right, so let's uh, let's not have you attack me while I'm on my way up. Also, this area doesn't, this sub area doesn't look all that different. Either I've just adapted to the to the way that they're displayed here. Again, because like I said, I used to play this on an old LCD TV where like the reds and like warm colors were super blown out. So this kind of just looks like the normal level to me. Okay, now all we need is the log rolling star. 
and so we can come back and get that later. If we need it. If we need it, we'll come back and get it. Because that feels better to know that we have spare stars that are easy enough to just accomplish real quick. Let me play with my left hand while I take a sip. Or not my left hand, but my right hand, because my left hand's on WASD normally. Even when playing with my right hand. Even when playing with my right hand, I'm doing solid. Okay, we got uh, Hazy Maze Cave, which is going to be a very annoying one to do. Uh, annoying one to do mirrored. Or annoying to do in one run. But I'll tell you what else we got. We got this freebie here to begin with. So that's another Castle Secret Star. Let's get deep in here. Take a little plunge into the oil. Uh, but no, yeah, this is, a, this is a level that is extremely secular. And so it's going to be... Oh god, the mirroring already screwing me over. I don't like this level a whole lot, so I'm probably not going to do my best to get all shine or shines. I keep saying shines. Getting all stars in this one. But I will definitely take a crack at a few of them. Stop doing that. Mario, come on. Don't be a fool. All right. Very green, this one. Yeah, not that I mind. Oh, we get Watch for Rolling Rocks right up here. This is me when I watch for Rolling Rocks. With zero A presses, because there is no A button on my keyboard. Alright, Rolling Rocks star gripped. Oh, they're metallic in here. They're like more metallic than usual. That's neat. Uh, let's see what we can do about 100 coins. I'm not sure how easy 100 coins is for this one. But it's always worth a try. That's exactly where we need to be. I need to go get those coins that we missed out on, though. That's very important to me that I get those. Go. Cool. Alright, Mario, damn. It's like a weird mirroring. I'm not sure it's 100% just the level geometry as normal, but flipped. You know? I'm not sure at all that that's what this is. Alright, let's see. Oh, the water's different. The water is definitively different. Is Dory any different? I hope not. I like Dory the way they are. Like... All right, so weird, weird question, right? This is gonna come off as super weird, unusual, and odd. Did I just swim through Dory? That's not the weird question, but like, uh, it is Dory related. Dory, she, they, 100%, right? All the time. Like, there's simply no way that that's not accurate. Ah, oh, come on. Let me up. Let me do the slow Mario in water turn. You know the one. Let's go all the way up here. And come on, Dory. Cooperate with me, will ya? I don't want to have to do the thing. I hate doing the thing so much because she makes like a wretched noise when you do it. And it's like, that's the intended way. And it's like, why? Why are Nintendo developers so cruel? You know what I could probably do? Not what I wanted. Oh, right. The kicks don't work. I can't do my little kicks in water. Or on, like, a jump out of water. No. Okay, so I can't just do the simple uh, kick. Yes, I did swim through Dory earlier, and I just did it again. Here we are. Oh, come on. Give me the... Oh, wait, no. I was doing my kicks wrong. Get to a stance and try it again. Because I'm still pretty sure the water thing applies for 
making the kicks work. Oh, it's too steep of a slope anyhow. I still can't believe my texture filtering settings are the thing that broke this. I'm sorry, I'm still on that. Like, seriously? You're the one- my, my brother in Christ, you implemented the texture filtering. It's not like a thing with the original game that just breaks easy. That's just, you know, a thing you implemented that is now broken with your textures. Like, why would you... I mean, I suppose that's why it was in red, but, like... God, it's like the, the place where the neck and the head meet. And turn. And turn. No, 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 turn back. Dang it, with the ground pounds. It's so hard for me to set up a long jump with these controls. And that's exactly what I need to do to get this. Is a long jump. Oh my god, we're almost at like 10,000 dropped frames across the whole stream. What if I just went for the... And I didn't even need to! I didn't even need to do the jump! Are you kidding? God. So annoying. Anyway. First star acquired. Uh, what else can we do down here? We could ride Dory up to there and do that. Yes. Cause that's, uh, I think that's the metal cap room, yeah? Or is that the... No, 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 no. That's the long jumping room. The metal cap room is attached to the poison... The toxic maze. The Britney Spears toxic maze. Uh... Let's see. I love that this area just has no ceiling. Like, because when you play the game initially, you don't see that high up. Like, your viewing angle is just not that high up. Let's go this way. Where's two friends? There's two friends hanging out. Come on, Dory. Stop jerking me around here. Dory is very hard to control, but not like the hardest thing in the world to control, so it's not as big of an issue as it is with uh, things like the wing cap in this game. For me, at least. I have trouble with the wing cap. I don't know of anybody else who really has that much of an issue with the wing cap. Oh, no, 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 no. This is the metal cap room. Fuck what we were just doing. We're doing metal cap now. Oh, my coin counter resets in here, so it doesn't matter. Unless there's a 100 coin star for being in here. Which I would honestly believe at this point. Because it's got its own 8 red coins. It's got... A bunch of coins in the water. Let's get this red coin star, shall we? To... God, some of these tricky jumps in the original game are so much easier with the advent of being able to just manipulate the camera in any way you want. Like, before this, I never really understood the whole Mario 64's camera sucks argument. And I was like, yeah, it's not the best in the world. But, like, I think it controls fine. But, like, not realizing the whole time that, hey, it's not about the controls, but... It's, it's definitely about just the viewing angles that the camera chooses to give you and the fact that you can't really adjust them all that much. And so you just kind of have to get good within those boundaries. And I did. And so it's very hard to... Uh... So uh, now we go home, right? Now we get pushed out and sent all the way back. Yeah? Those coins not despawn? I want to get the rest of these coins in here. Something tells me that uh, there might be a plentiful amount of coinage in this small area. Maximum coinage. 
Bam, 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 bam. Love the metal cap theme, it's very good. It's got a vibe about it, yeah. I wanna get that coin box over there. Ah, oh, hell yeah, one up time. Give me the one up. Give me the one up, dude. Okay. Uh, do I get to keep my metal cap if I leave this area with the metal cap on? Let's find out. Let's toy around with it a little bit. That just kills now? Why does that kill now? It's supposed to like link you out to the courtyard, but now it counts as a kill? Huh. I don't play around with Hazy Maze Cave right now, I don't think. I'd be fine with the uh, maybe shifting Sandland, but like, bah. Bah, I say, bah. Oh, no, we could do in the meantime. While we're between stages. Could come in here. And we can lower the moat so that we can do vanish cap. Famished cap. He's very hungry. The very hungry guy. That famished capped fella. Alright, that's enough of that joke. <laughs> uh yeep. Come on, let me up. I gave it a yeep, and you didn't let me up? What are the swim controls of this version? They're so weird. It feels like every body of water has its own strange current. When, like, this is still water for sure. By the way, this water's gross. Like, gross is all hell for sure. Because, like, it's flooding. It's just, like, in this, in this tiny space, realistically, this water is disgusting. Insanely grimy. And you know what? I'm not sure how that helps. And then we could step outside. And the moat's empty. And we're flipped still. Great. Yeah. Then down into Vanish Cap. It's orange in here. I want to see what I can do about uh, getting myself mm, a little bit of uh, a little bit of red coinage. All right, there we go, and then we collect one over here. This is straight down from here. Yeah, with nothing we can really do there, right? Can I get more coin? I can have more coin, yeah. Why wouldn't I be allowed to have more coin? Five. Okay, just barely made that one. Oh, you missed that one. Okay, that's seven. And eight is right there. I don't think I've ever sw swung through this level so easily. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum, ba -da -ba -dum, bum, 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 bum. They even considered the soft lock there. They even considered the fact that you could soft lock here and gave you a jump out. <sighs> I remember seeing a mod a long time ago that would, um, that changed the way that worked, uh, where that hole would jump you down to other geometry. Uh, this should take us back to where we need to be, yeah. Where that, uh, hole, you could jump down there and then there would be more level down there. Like, I saw that at a very young age, and it's just forever warped my perception of that level. 
Um, let's take a take a little trip to Shifting Sandland. I think that could be worth our while. That way is Toad. Uh, I think we need to head over this way. God, that feels weird. I'm still not used to the mirroring. After all this playtime, I'm still not used to it. I'm very scared that the mirror is going to screw up uh, in the talents of the big bird. It's going to screw up my ability to play the game normally at some point. Like, it's just going to infest me. All right, I'll kill him. Sure. I'll murder. I got nothing better to do. All right, first things first. 100 coins, 8 red coins. Let's see if we can manage those in this first little go round. Because I feel like we can. Come on, I'll get close enough one of these days. Ah, oh, so much coin. Give me the coin! Thank you. <laughs> 35, oh, I thought it said 35 coins, 35 stars. 10 coins, and we haven't even left, like, the first little stump of the level. I think we've got this one. I think we've got this one under lock and key at this point. Like, it is done-zo, and it's barely begun-zo. Okay. We got two pokies? I could have swore there was only one pokey in this level. Mario 64 pokey is nightmare fuel, by the way. I just want to mention. I can kill him, take his coin. Come on. Give me one. Give me two. And... Give me three. That's what I like to see. That's what I like. Give me the box, please. We can't do this every time I have a box. Come on. It can't happen that way. All right, that one's lost to time. There are no coins that are reachable from that box. Did I just screw myself forever? Like, eternally? Probably not. Okay, so the secret is, as long as Big Bird is carrying that star... It can't make the effort to come and kill me, or come and take my hat off me, rather. And so, that means I can do a little funny, like this right here, and uh, not be bothered about it. Unless he comes around, in which case I'll grab it from him, why not? Uh-oh. My ancient enemy. The fly guy. Okay, fly guy, I'm leaving. I'm leaving, you don't have to attack me about it, I'm leaving. Okay, if we get the right distance away, we should be able to... There, there are a couple stars that are going to be a little difficult with this one, if we try to get them. Namely, the red coin star. For simple fact of, like... You'd have to... Can go up the four pillars on this? I can, yeah. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. Uh, anyway, there's some stars, namely the red coin star, that are gonna be- Oh, wow, that's a stark change to this blue down here. Is it getting bluer? I feel like it's bluer down here than it was. Nah, no, it's just me. Uh, some stars in Shifting Sandland are gonna be a little more difficult. Because we need to, uh... We need to use the wing cap to get the eight red coins. Well, I say to get the eight red coins. We need to use the wing cap to get the uh, the first, like, or the last two red coins. So, and like, even that's just flying a straight line. All right, let me get that there fly guy dealt with. I think he's a fly guy, right? The other ones are, uh... They're the guys with, like, the gas masks that are Sniffits, right? Yeah. I see a lot of people confuse Sniffit for a shy guy. He is not, in fact, a shy guy. He's a Sniffit. Very, very different. 
Do you guys remember the period of time where everyone on the internet was obsessed with finding out what was under Shy Guy's mask? Uh, because of that, like, scene in, like, one of the Mario sports games where, like, he wins and he goes to, like, waddle up, like, a little guy to come and get the uh, trophy and his mask falls off. So Luigi gets to see what's underneath. And so, like, Luigi knows, but, like, he looks at it like he's seen some ancient horror. And so... My best guess is we probably don't want to know. Whatever it is. Okay. So my initial plan, unlike in the last level, did not work here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw it at this pillar instead. Broke it. Grabbed the coins. You didn't even get to hear them. Oh my god, they went up. They up warped. I upwarped some coins, and then I made one unreachable. We got two out of three, though. Which is not awful. It's definitely better than how we did last time. Come on. Give me that red coin action. Yeah! 28 coins. Look at us go. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, stand right here. Okay, we just barely made that. Three red coins now? Squid game? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, we made it. We made it. We would have been fine where we were standing, actually. Now that I think on it. Oh, no, there are three pokies in this level. Because there's a pokey over here. Pokey dokey. Parokey dokey. How about I stand atop this pillar and wait for my old friend Klepto to get over here? Why'd he do that? Why'd he have to do that? Does that kill him, or does he just continue around the level? Because now that's going to make my life a little harder. But we got a star out of it. Now that's going to make my life a little harder by four pokies in this level? This is getting ridiculous. The ever-increasing amount of pokies in this level. A number truly unmatched by the rest of Mario 64's levels. Suppose it is the only desert one, so. Uh, the thing we need is over here. We need the coin from standing on this pillar. Again, all the inside the pyramid stuff will probably have to be done in one runabout. If I had to guess. If no other reason than because it's like its own sub area and so... We might be able to go in there for the 100 coins. No! Well, it looks like we're doing everything separately now. Jeez. God, this level's such a pain. I'll give it one more good, honest try. I'm not gonna get the 100 coins, though. Or the red coins. We're going inside the pyramid. That's the, that's the name of the star, right? Shimmering atop the pyramid. So you gotta get it to the top of the pyramid. Insanely doable. Here's what you're gonna wanna do to get inside the pyramid, or on top of the pyramid to get to that star. Step one. Fail at the jump. Step two. Go back. Try the jump again. And fail it a second time. Alright. And step three is a very vital one. Get up on the thing. Get the shell. Don't fail the jump the third time. If you fail it the third time, you, you're fucking sucked and you're lame. Step four, die. Because the level is mirrored. Step five, go back in. You're gonna wanna, you're gonna wanna re-enter the level. Again, the re-entry is very important. All of these steps are absolutely necessary to getting the star. If you do this, if you try to do this method, by shortcutting it and cutting corners, you're not going to get the star. Step five, fail to jump a third time. But but after the restart, you can't fail it three times in a row pre the restart. Again, or else you suck and you're lame. Fail it a fourth. And then... 
Step number five, I want seven. Step number seven. Get another shell. And this time, take the shell and start scaling the pyramid. Use your jump if you have to. And then let the shell die on the wall while you grab the star. Done. My easy seven step plan. What if I kill you, Klepto? What if I take you out? Oh, you bastard, you got my hat. Now I gotta get it back. Alright, Schmepto. Get back over here. Got my hat back. Did not get my hat back. What the fuck? I, I hit him. I hit him. Do I not get my hat back? Okay, he dropped it. Good. I feel like getting the 100 coins, though. Part of me kind of feels like getting those 100 coins would be worth my while. I overshot just a bit. Oh, 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 oh. Got swept up in the tornad. Tornad helped me get the coin. Tornad would have probably helped me get the coin if I had thought of it in time. Sadly, I was a little late on my thunk. Hey, don't get slope speed and go running into the thing, please. Oh, well. And I got the coin, though. I got the coin. And that's what matters to me, really, is that I got the coin at the end of the day. Oh, well. Uh, let's go fight another Bowser, I think. I think we should fight another Bowser because we have the stars to do so. We're almost 10 over the amount of stars we need to do that. So we could probably go and do this. God, where is the way out? <laughs> I think it's this way, yeah? Yeah. And then we can go upstairs and do some stars up there if we wanted. Got a feeling, though, based on the time that... We're only going to be able to crack out this Bowser, and then we'll be at three, and then I'm probably going to end it, just because Bowser's a good end point, I feel, for these. And then we can do some more running around next week, huh? We can have some more Bing Bing Wahoos in place of our portal segment. Maybe including a portal segment, because I'm not sure I have another, I'm not sure I have another, you know, three hours of Bing Bing Wahoos in this game. Ooh... I like this. I really like this. Right, it's time for me to go. Down into the depths. This is the best music track in the game. The entire game. Yes, the whole game. This is the best music track in the game. In the entire game. Boom, boom. <laughs> Womp's Fortress is pretty good. But the underwater music cannot be beat. <laughs> Thank you for indulging my not musically inclined nonsense. I just really like this track, all right? It's the best one. <laughs> A lot of good music in Sunshine. But, oh man, does this this pink water really adds to the aesthetic here. I like it. This is, this is endearing me to this stage a lot. Do both water stages look like this? Because I might need to make a return. Dum, 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 dum. Doom, 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 doom. It's making me not care about my mistakes at all, either. Oh, but we're already done here. The sub! It disappears! Because it's only there for star one, so now it's gone. All right, we got what we needed. We'll come back to that, of course. I'm not going to just leave that forever now. 38 stars going into upstairs is not a bad position to be in, honestly. Because you need, like, what, 70? Uh, well, you need, like, 60 to open the door to get to second upstairs, and then... Oh, wait. Let me back in here. No, not in here. The other door. They're flipped, because mirror. Uh, but, like... 
I think you need like 60 to get to the next, get through the next star door, and then 70 to get through the final star door. Oh. Let's see what this Bowser stage looks like, yeah? Another one throw Andy through here. Come on. Let me up. Thank you. And over here. And over here. And then right over here. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We're sticking right here until the until the water's clear a little with this bully. And now we can move on. Woo! I like this Bowser stage. This Bowser stage is one of the good ones. Not that they're all not good, because I like all of them, but that was a double negative. But I, I rest assured, I enjoy all the Bowser stages, but I really like this one. I like the, like, linear obstacle course style that the Bowser stages in this game have. Why is, th why is there no transparency? Oh, because it's on the other side, right. I can't chain my wall jumps as easily as I normally would be able to. Get a couple more of those. And straight up here. Bro, straight up. <laughs> I'm gonna straight shit my pants, dog. No cap. No cap, I'm shitting right now, fam. Alright. Up and out. Again, the mirror isn't super affecting me in these linear stages. Because, like, I could just, like, flip the camera around and it's normal. Okay. See, look. This is backwards. And this is, like, the, the most backwards portion, though. Like, if there was a spot to notice that this has been flipped, it's definitely here. Please get out of there. Okay. I need to chill out. I need coin before I go in here. We're going straight in. Fuck it. What's the worst that could happen? Bowser drops coins. On his fire. If I could survive fire once. I've been on fire once. It's fine. Oh, I'm dead. That's okay, making it to the Bowser fight means I just get booted here. Oh, we've got zero lives. We get one attempt at this, huh? You want me to take one shot at this, huh? Oh, boy. Okay. Let's get as far this way as possible. Blah, 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 blah. Blah. I always hated this Bowser for his teleport. I hate him for his teleportation swag. Unbelievably swagged out. It's more echoey in here, I feel. The last one was emerald, and now this one's like a like a green, I feel. Oh, he's right next to that. If I could just not overshoot it, he's dead instantly. See, it's not that tough, it's just... Hey, welcome in! I haven't seen you in a bit either. In fact, your name actually is slipping my mind at the moment, very embarrassingly. But welcome in, it's good to see you. Thanks for coming and witnessing this Bowser fight with me. Heck yeah, when's the last time you were in? Alright, that's a save and continue. All right, I think that'll do us. I think second Bowser is a good ending point for us. Yeah, I feel like I've definitely hit my good end spot. Let's take our take our pause. Aren't you the one who uh, who raised me on my first stream? I think so. I, I'm i sorry, my memory is awful for these sorts of things. Rated. Yes, yes. 
Uh, I believe at oh, I'm terrible at like remembering who I've raided, but no, yeah, I totally probably have definitely raided you at some point. That's a lot of uh, adjective for that. But no, yeah, I probably did. Speaking of raids, I think I might skip out on a raid this time because we're one viewer. The view count like dropped because I said I was ending soon. Uh, but we're going to head over to our stream end screen. And I'm going to do a quick outro. Yeah, all right. Glad to hear it was me. How's how's it going? How have you been? I'd love to hear about that while I'm doing the outro here. Real quick, though. Quick thing. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the stream as much as I've enjoyed doing it. It's been an amazing time to do that, uh, to, to like be here and do this again for this Saturday. I'll be back on Monday. I stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Uh, let's see. What else? Uh, I've got a VODs channel over on YouTube where I drop all my VODs, exclamation point VODs in the chat. I'll put that in and that'll, great. I've been doing better on getting viewers. That's amazing. It's good to hear. Uh, that'll link you straight to the YouTube channel in which you can see all my VODs. Uh, exclamation point socials will give you that. And you know what? I think we will do a raid. I think we will do a raid. Exclamation point socials will give you my link tree where you can do that. And uh, one last thing, exclamation point discord is new. I hate to keep harping on it, but uh, there's our community Discord where you can see all the content that I post in one place and interact with other people from the community. So yeah, that's that's that. Let's find somebody to raid, shall we? Speaking of raids, uh, let's go here and go to Twitch and see who's live. Who's living? Carlo is live, and they're playing Stray. Stray's great. I love Stray so much. Glad I got to come back. Yeah, I'm glad you came. Uh, ex uh, I keep doing exclamation point raid. Slash raid. Carlo. Bears. Right? That's the correct account. Yeah? Yeah, okay. I always get confused. Uh, but, no, yeah, it's been great. Send Carlo, send Carlo my, uh, my support. And tell him the rat sent you. Have a good one. And enjoy the stream. See you around.